थर्टी फर्स्ट प्रॉब्लम एवेल्युएट इंटेग्रल ऑफ वन बाई वन प्लस साइन टू एक्स डी एक्स ओके नाउ फर्स्ट लेट अस सिंपलीफाई वन प्लस साइन टू एक्स वैल्यू यूजिंग ट्रिग्नामेट्रिक फंक्शंस दिस वन प्लस साइन टू एक्स कैन बी रिटर्न वन इज रिप्लेस्ड बाय कॉस स्क्वायर एक्स प्लस साइन स्क्वायर एक्स this is 2 sin x cos x this is in the form of a square plus b square plus 2ab so this is nothing but cos x plus sin x whole square now here solution let i is equal to integral of 1 by 1 plus sin 2x dx this is replaced by this value so this is equal to integral 1 by cos x plus sin x whole square dx now how shall we proceed further take cos x common if you take cos x common you will be getting cos square x out taken out so 1 by cos square x is taken out in the place of cos x 1 this here sin x by cos x whole square dx now 1 by cos square x is secant square x secant square x by 1 plus sin x by cos x is tan x so 1 plus tan x whole square dx now secant square x is the derivative of 1 plus tan x so now put 1 plus tan x is equal to t differentiate both sides with respect to x so we get secant square x is equal to dt by dx now dt is equal to secant square x dx so this can be secant square x dx is dt so this can be written integral 1 by t square dt this is minus 1 by t what is t t is nothing but 1 plus tan x so this is equal to minus 1 by 1 plus tan x plus constant of integration thirty second problem evaluate integral of x square plus 1 by x to the power of 4 plus 1 dx now i is equal to integral x square plus 1 by x to the power of 4 plus 1 dx here in this case it had better to do divide both numerator and denominator by x square let us see so divide both numerator and denominator by x square see here we get x square plus 1 by x square upon x to the power of 4 plus 1 upon x square or by x square dx now this becomes 1 plus 1 by x square by x to the power of 4 by x square that is x square plus 1 by x square dx so now x square plus 1 by x square is the part of the x plus x 1 by x whole square or x minus 1 by x whole square so better you try x minus 1 by x whole square this is x square plus 1 by x square minus 2 so that means this x square 
plus 1 by x square can be written as x minus 1 by x whole square plus 2. So, now let us substitute here. This can be written 1 by x minus 1 by x whole square plus 2 into 1 plus 1 by x square dx. Now, put x minus 1 by x is equal to t. Differentiate both sides with respect to x. Derivative of x is 1, derivative of 1 by x is minus 1 by x square into minus 1 plus 1 by x square is equal to dt by dx. Now, dt is equal to 1 plus 1 by x square dx. Now, this is nothing but dt, this will be t. Now, this becomes integral 1 by t square plus 2 dt that is in the form of a 1 by a square plus x square. So, integral 1 by root 2 whole square plus t square dt. So, we can apply this formula integral 1 by a square plus x square dx that is 1 by a tan inverse x by a. So, this is equal to 1 by a 1 by root 2 tan inverse t by root 2, but what is t in this problem x minus 1 by x replace. So, we get 1 by root 2 tan inverse of 1 by root 2 times x minus 1 by x plus constant of integration. Thirty three evaluate integral of dx by cos square x plus sin two x solution i is equal to integral one by cos square x plus sin two x sin 2 x here d x. Now, this is 1 by cos square x plus sin 2 x is 2 sin x cos x d x. Now, take this cos square x common. So, now 1 by cos square x is taken out, we get 1 plus 2 sin x cos x by cos square x dx. See 1 by cos square x is secant square x. So, this is equal to integral secant square x by now, here cos x, cos x cancel, sin x by cos x is tan x. So, 1 plus 2 tan x dx. This we can write 1 by 1 plus 2 tan x into this we can write 2 secant square x into 1 by 2 dx. So, why should we write like this? the derivative of 1 plus 2 tan x is 2 secant square x multiply to divide by 2. So, this will be in the form of integral f dash x by f of x dx. So, this is log mod f of x plus constant of integration. Since this is f of x, this will be f dash x log of mod of 1 plus 2 tan x. So, half times log mod 1 plus 2 tan x plus constant of integration. 
Now, let us move to the next problem, 34th problem. Evaluate integral of root of 1 minus sin 2x dx. Okay. Now, regarding this problem, 1 minus sin 2x can be written as cos square x plus sin square x minus 2 sin x cos x. So, 1 is replaced by the identity, one of the trigonometric identities that is cos square x plus sin square x. This is a square plus b square minus 2ab. This is cos x minus sin x whole square. So, now square root of this one is cos x minus sin x. Now, i equals to integral root of 1 minus sin 2x dx. It is converse. So, we get this is integral of cos x minus sin x dx. So, separating integral of cos x dx minus integral of sin x dx. See here integral of cos x dx is sin x and integral of sin x dx is minus cos x minus into minus plus. So, sin x plus cos x plus c. 